possible relief for long haulers, the people who still have COVID symptoms months after recovering from the virus. Some of them report the vaccines have stopped their symptoms. Ariel Reshef has that story for us. This morning, a medical mystery unfolding as some COVID long haulers say that getting vaccinated helped relieve their symptoms. I feel so much better. It has given me a lot of hope that I can get back to myself again. 53-year-old Gerilyn Lucas was diagnosed with the disease in March of 2020, hospitalized with double pneumonia, and ever since has suffered debilitating stomach problems, jitters, and difficulty breathing. And now, after completing both shots of the vaccine, I have finally started to feel like myself. And for 32-year-old Mary Ellis Santiago, a similar story. I was having like shivers, I was sweating a lot. Um, with that, I was tired. My body was extremely tired. She's been documenting her battle on social media, counting 66 days without a sense of smell or taste. But after her first dose of the vaccine... Within 24 to 48 hours, I regained my senses again. I feel like my body's a little bit more energized. Experts say there is still not enough data to draw a direct link between the COVID-19 vaccine and a reduction in long hauler symptoms. But they say the psychological impact is clear. Research shows 10% of COVID-19 patients become long haulers, enduring symptoms beyond three to four weeks after testing positive. Right now, doctors still trying to understand if and how a vaccine might help, but they have some theories. The vaccine induces very good immune responses against the virus that can clean up any residual or leftover virus. Just this week, Texas Roadhouse founder and CEO Kent Taylor died by suicide. His family saying the 65-year-old took his own life after symptoms like severe tinnitus stemming from his battle with COVID-19 became unbearable. And experts say that this vaccine was created as a preventative measure, not as a treatment, but they do say that this is a way to return back to some degree of normalcy. Robin, so you're going to, by the way, want to hang on to those vaccine cards. Very important. Very important indeed, Ariel. Thank you very much. And the three of us, we have our vaccination cards. Yes. I got mine yesterday. Got my second shot yesterday. How Little, you feeling, Robin? Just, you know, no real major ones. I know that you all the same, just kind of little puny. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. tired, chills, it's but really worth good. it. What? Worth it, worth it. And we didn't want to bring our cards down as props because they're in safe places. <laughs> safe places. <laughs> yeah. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.